Hello, I'm here for another reaction, and this time I'm about to watch uh, My Little Pony, Season 9, Episode 8, uh, titled Frenemies. I did see a screenshot of this episode, and I, so I know it's a... Uh, apparently it involves the return of our uh, the group of villains from the season premiere, so uh, uh, Grogar, Chrysalis, T-Rex, and Cozy Glow. Uh, but I don't have any other info on it. Uh, the only thing I know is that these uh, these villains are in it. So I don't know what this is about. Uh, if it's like, about them trying to... Some kind of new evil plan or maybe just trying to get along with each other. I mean, judging by the title, maybe they're just trying to try to be... Uh, well, I don't know about friends, but at least work together. Which I assume is... Probably not going to work out all that well, considering that they, <laughs> yeah, they have conflicting interests. Uh, okay, maybe Grogar might might be trying to uh, have them all work together, but I'm, I'm not sure. Yeah, I don't know how well that's going to work, but uh, yeah, like I said, I don't, yeah, I don't even really, I'm just guessing, I really don't know what it's about, so I'll go ahead and start the episode to find out. Okay, yeah, their uh, their little hideout. What is, what is that? Some special artifact? Left food out. Okay, yeah, we're just dealing with their little issues with each other. Anything that nosy little says. <laughs> I don't oh, wow. Any of you say. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. <laughs> Are you planning on attacking any pony anytime soon? Uh, I don't know why I'm wasting my time here. Oof. I am a queen, you know. Well, not really. You don't have any subjects, so I don't. I don't know if you can really. It's impossible to accomplish the work I need to do here. I suggest the three of you come to some kind of accord. Oh <laughs> wow! I don't care how. But you must learn to work together. Okay, Only yeah. Then can we accomplish what you so greatly desire? The defeat of Twilight Sparkle and her friends. My this sounds interesting. Pony, Are, is this really just going to be about just watching the villains? <laughs> just This could be <laughs> Just hearing their gripes about each other and trying to get along. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, poor Grogar, just trying to, to trying to execute an evil plot, and all his uh, roommates there are just keep hassling him about each other, about their annoyances with each other. All right, setting up a hammock. An inspirational banner. Oh, a banner. When Grogar sees this, he'll realize there's no way he could survive without me. Uh. You're gonna have to exercise a lot to get as big as you were when you absorbed the life force of all those ponies. <laughs> Anywho, Grogar wants us all to work together, so I've scheduled a team meeting. Doesn't that sound fun? And uh. Rogar left me in charge. No, he didn't. <laughs> Someone's a real grumpy toward today. Oh, wow. If we aren't meeting, I guess I could just stay and offer positive and inspiring. Oh, could you just, like, that. shut up, Cozy Glow? Just leave. <laughs> See you soon. It's been weeks, and Rogar has done nothing. It's not healthy to hold on to all of this rage. I could lash out at any moment. And how are you doing this fight? How do you think I'm doing? I'm ready to exact my revenge! Of course. See what I mean? Being cooped up with nothing Wait, to do is the Who or what is she even talking to? Is that a, one of those pieces of wood I that do meteors? Grogar left me in charge. From the mean no, six. Didn't. And even if he did, Chrysalis obeys no one. There'll be cupcakes. Mm. Grogar wants us to work together <laughs> to defeat our enemies. Which means we need to trust each other. Uh, if we are to trust one another, perhaps yeah. inform Lord <laughs> to stop trying to absorb my guess. <laughs> I wasn't doing anything of the sort. Oh wow. <laughs> How dare you? 
Do you know to whom you are speaking? Don't bother saying you're a queen. This is why Grogar left me in charge. No, he didn't. Wait, are you singing a song? This could be real. <laughs> I think I know a way that we can grow. Time to try something new, something better. No more so low. Trust is the way to go. And all we need to do is work together. Oh, please. No thanks, no way. I feel the need to say. I'm smarter, stronger, and I don't need you to. Ha! Stronger? Okay. I guess we'll damn play. How bad you got your rear and hand it to you. <laughs> it's time to try a better way to be bad. Do we really need a better way to be bad? <laughs> Teamwork, please. What a bad. Combine all our strength. We'll go to any length once we have a better way to be bad. Let's go begin. This time we're gonna win. Oh. The ice are on is thin, so watch what you say. I know you're in. I think I see a grin. For all this pain and torture, I swear you'll pay. <laughs> this time we've got uh. a better way. There's better way to be bad. <laughs> United as one will make those ponies so sad. Oh, this is hilarious. Okay, would you just go away? We want to break their friendship. We want to make them weak. You want revenge on Starlight. You want that huge physique. So let's increase our chances by working as a team to crush our enemies to death and laugh as they all scream. <laughs> I think I see a better way to be bad. Just put me in charge, make me queen, you'll be glad. No, listen to me, I'm the best of us three. Then, then you'll see, see a better way, way to be bad. Wait, this is my thing, a better way to be bad. You shall do as I command, I will rule this trial. Uh, this is my job. Sorry, not any longer. A better way to be bad. Now you're making me mad. <laughs> Villain just sing. <laughs> this is <so> funny. <laughs> wow. I had hoped by now you would have resolved your differences, but apparently not. Perhaps if we knew what the plan was, we would be better able to prepare. Assuming you even have a plan. Of course I have a plan. Hmm. I have located an object of power, and it occurs to me this is the perfect test. The three of you will work together to retrieve it. Oh, okay. Against this item, those ponies won't stand a chance. What is it? Something? Some? I have come close something to new? Ruling Equestria several times. Perhaps I should be the one to lead us. Uh, I really drained all the magic from Equestria. That was good. <laughs> I absorbed all the magic of Equestria. I could feel it flowing through my body. And yet, all three of you lost. Oh! Each of you failed to defeat Twilight Sparkle and her friends. Yep. My power is greater than all of yours combined. This is but a fraction of it. Understood? Uh, okay. Oh. Now you shall retrieve the rest of it. Oh, some artifact of moons holding his power. Self righteous Gusty the Great, okay. unable to mess me face to face, stole my bewitching bell. Bewitching bell? Talisman containing much of my own magic. Mm. The bell cannot be destroyed. So Gusty hid it in a place it has taken me millennia to discover. An enchanted cave high atop Mount Everhoof. Protected by Not magical winds that prevent any pony from reaching its peak. There the bell has remained until now. Scale Mount Everhoof. Bring me back my bell. <laughs> the ease of this task is laughable. 
Uh huh. Wait, are we even gonna see the main six? Like, not even any of the heroes at all? Just, just these villains? This is something. This is something new. <laughs> Never seen this before. Retrieve Grogar's bell. Together! I drew up a detailed plan with several visual aids to show how we can. Uh, yeah, they're. <laughs> Maybe when I'm waiting for them at the top, then they'll appreciate me. Uh. What? What is that? <laughs> As if anything on this mountain is scary. Turn than around, I. she's gonna see something. <laughs> oh, can you do that? Hmm? <laughs> oh, is someone living up here? Who Who's this? There? A pony? There ain't been ponies around here, and I don't know how many moons. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, Only a little me, act. Sir. I'm just a poor lost pony looking for help. Oh, don't fret, little <laughs> filly. Old Rusty Bucket here at your service. I'm so glad I found you. I need help getting to the top of the mountain. Uh, no can do, ma'am. Why not? Why not? <laughs> So loud! This here's avalanche territory. I'm the guardian of this here mountain. It's my job to keep ponies from heading up. Nothing at the top but dangerous snow, dangerous ice, and dangerous wind. Basically, it's dangerous. <laughs> it must get lonely all by yourself. Maybe I could be your friend? Oh, I'd love a friend. <laughs> so Not her as a friend. a friend. You could help me up the mountain. A real friend wouldn't ask me to do something I'm not supposed to do. Says so right here in the Journal of Friendship. Oh. Like <laughs> nice to see someone learning from the journal. Oh dear. I didn't want to be friends anyway. <laughs> oh. Uh oh. <laughs> doing <laughs> no not that way neither no <sighs> <laughs> oh no Oh, don't just start avalanches. Now just calm down there, Philly. You calm down. Ponies are supposed to do what I ask them to do. It's like my thing. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> See you later. Apparently, I don't need any pony elves. Uh, is that going to be strong enough to beat those wings? Yeah. <laughs> it's not funny, T Rex. Yes, it is. Make it to the top. Surprise, surprise. You didn't make it to the top either. I didn't try to. What? It took about five minutes to deduce that Grogar was right. None of us could make it up alone. So rather than subject myself to the elements, I decided to let you two face the danger. <laughs> Take what you learned and use it to my advantage. 
I put up with your I'm smarter than you attitude in Tartarus, but I'm over it. I've had enough of you trying to manipulate me with that insincere, syrupy sweetness. At least now we can see the real you. This is not the real me! I'm cute and lovable! <laughs> Clearly. No, you're not! You're annoying and you uh oh. I do not snore! Okay, now they're gonna be forced to have to work together to deal with the uh, whatever this is. Wait, wait, what? Grand Grand? <laughs> what are these things? Uh. Oh, okay. It's distracted. Let's go. Wait. Mm, so much love. I haven't eaten this well in ages. So gross. Just so we're clear, I didn't save you because I like you. I did it because, because I need. <laughs> Clearly, I was right to wait. Now, tell me everything you learned today. Leave nothing out. I learned, uh, <laughs> we can't get to the top of the mountain. Why are you doing that? Didn't you already drain it of love? I always save a little for the next day. You cocoon all of your meals? Of course. So when you pony nap Twilight and the others, you cocooned them? Yes, until that sow starlight glimmer freed them, corrupted my subjects, and stole my hive. Those ponies have weaknesses. I used that turncoat discord, tricked him into helping me capture his so-called friends. Uh, discord was really something until friendship ruined him. <laughs> you should have seen Twilight's face when her friends appeared in bubbles around me. She was all... <laughs> <laughs> She's so stressed out all the time. Posed as her former foal sitter, I thought she was going to implode. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could have seen her face when I nearly erased all the magic from Equestria. Oh, magic was a little excessive, don't you think? Nah, I think big. Besides, <laughs> it would have been worth it just to see Twilight and her friends bow down to me. Indeed it would. Who wouldn't love to see those prissy ponies realize they lost everything? I'm a pathetic princess. <laughs> I made a detailed list of all the ways I'm a failure. <laughs> <laughs> you know, working with you two may not be the worst thing. <laughs> Perhaps. As long as it results in the complete destruction of our enemies. I wouldn't have it any other way. Mm. Do the pathetic princess mm. thing again. <laughs> uh, okay, I guess that's the closest we'll get to seeing any uh, anyone other than these villains. <laughs> okay. I'm okay. I don't think they care. Oh, okay. Huh, they might actually succeed in working together, okay. For the moment. Oh, some kind of magical uh, force field. Can you absorb it and make it go away? I can only absorb magic from living beings. Huh. Like her? Uh. Betrayal. Not betrayal. Teamwork. If T Rex absorbs your energy, he might be strong enough to break through. And then? Then he gives it back. Uh, will he? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. 
How do I know you won't take my magic and leave me? Would you don't. Do that to you? <laughs> okay, normally, yes. <laughs> yep. I'll give you your magic back. Do it. So much power! Welcome back, baby! Is that gonna it's be enough? Big enough for me. Maybe not you! Keep it open, or I'll be trapped forever! Oh, he did manage to make a little uh, so opening. <laughs> Can't hold much longer! I assume she got it. Yep. The My magic. Bell or whatever. No, oh, he actually kept his word. I I wasn't sure you were going to give it back. Mm -hmm. Neither was I. <laughs> working together seemed smarter than to continue fighting. When we helped each other, it felt better somehow. I haven't felt like this since before I lost my hive. Having others who will be there for you is pleasing. Uh huh. All of these years, taking power from ponies. When you used your power to help others. Yes, it feels. No! Oh, no! <laughs> the magic of friendship is like a disease. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, we don't want that. No, 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 no. I've watched it infect my hive. I will not let it get me. Same. Obviously. Hmm. But Grogar said we have to work together. Grogar is too powerful. Something must be done about that. Let Grogar think we're his loyal servants. In the meantime, we'll hatch our own plan. Mm. I love a good backstabbing. <laughs> After that, we can go back to trying to destroy each other. <laughs> time, what do we do with this? You failed to retrieve the bell. What, what did they do with it? We work together as you asked. We just aren't as powerful as you. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, at least you finally did as you were told and worked together. Of course. Whatever you command. Forget about that old bell. You were right. We're so much more powerful when we work as a team. Hmm. Wow. Okay. Well, uh, that. That was really interesting. Uh, I, yeah, I believe this is the first time we've ever had an episode just uh, just watching the villains. Like, I mean, the closest there was to what well, there was to having any of the heroes, and there was a Chrysalis uh, momentarily just changing forms to <laughs> act as Twilight, but that was it. <laughs> just, it was all focused. It was just just watching these villains. <laughs> Yeah, th this was great. But yeah, of course, they have to learn. Yeah, they do have to learn about, yeah, teamwork, working together naturally. And yeah, they seem to be actively resisting. Oh, no, we can't let friendship infect us. Yeah. Um, foreshadowing, maybe? Hmm. <clears throat> Are these three going to have to work together with the heroes to defeat Grogar? Maybe? Even if, uh, even if they do end up turning on each other uh, uh, again after he's defeated? But, wow, yeah, I, I love this episode. And the, the great song, too, just the, <laughs> watching all these villains. Yeah, nice little, uh, yeah, the yeah villain song. Just <laughs> try to, what was it, the yeah, better way to be bad? <sighs> yeah, I did, did not expect that to have them uh, to just have this uh, whole thing, just whole episode, just just watching them and just try to get along with each other and <laughs> like this whole uh, big, big sitcom thing, just watch them annoy each other and <laughs> like right at the beginning they were just 
oh, yeah, he left food in the fridge and all this kind of stuff. Just, <laughs> just as they just try to learn to try to get along. And I guess now they, they will for the time being anyway. And they, but yeah, they, they even just, yeah, they, they outright said, yeah, well, yeah, we'll team up to, yeah, get our revenge and, uh, and then get take care, get rid of Grogar, and then then we'll just go ahead and uh, yeah, go back to yeah, trying to uh, defeat each other again. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> but yeah, this was great. Um, I really love the <laughs> scene. <laughs> yeah, cozy glow. Just try to convince that other pony. Uh, <laughs> yeah, she just says, oh yeah, I, uh, hey, other ponies are supposed to do what I say. That's my whole thing. <laughs> yeah, kind of. Yeah, it's like, uh, yeah, the, uh, the chess piece cutie mark, I guess. The, yeah, persuade others to do your bidding. <laughs> but yeah, just seeing the three of them just <laughs> argue and bicker with each other. <laughs> And then yeah, and yeah, they learn to work together for for now at least. So, our I wonder if we're gonna see see them again. Are we gonna see another episode maybe where they uh, where they try to come up with another plan or something? Or they're, I'm assuming yeah, they're definitely I, I I'm guessing they're definitely coming back at least in the finale. But uh, I don't know if we're gonna see them again before then. Yeah, I wasn't. <laughs> I said basically the same thing on the. When I watch the premiere, but and here we are now with this episode, so I don't know. But I kind of hope we do. It, this was a nice little uh, something different here with this episode. And anyway, uh, I don't have anything else, uh, so I'll uh, see you next episode then. Uh, until then, uh, later. Bye.